Dr. D from ExploreHolistic.com. Do you realize that every day thousands of dentists are placing all types of different dental materials into their patients' mouths without letting the patient know what some of the health implications may be? Are you sensitive to some of these materials? Are any of these materials toxic? We really don't know. However, as a holistic dentist, I'm going to be sharing with you my views on some of these incompatible dental materials and how you can stay safe in the dental office. So let's get going. So what is actually being put in your mouth? Your mouth is the entryway to your digestive tract, millimeters from your brain and the center of your emotional well-being, yet few discuss what products dentists use. Well, you should talk about it. In fact, more and more people are becoming labeled as, quote, chemically sensitive, as thousands and thousands of new chemicals are being introduced into our environment every year, many of which are not tested, according to EcoWatch, a longtime leader in environmental news. Many of these chemicals are commonly used in dental materials. The most obvious is the mercury in dental fillings. Did you know that those dark metal fillings you see are actually made up of 50% mercury? And that it leaches out toxic mercury vapor 24-7, 365 days a year through chewing, grinding, and drinking hot liquids, where it is both swallowed and inhaled. My goodness, who doesn't do any of those things? According to the World Health Organization, mercury is highly toxic to human health, so why have it in your mouth at all? For your own health, and especially the health of your children, avoid getting another, quote, mercury amalgam filling again. Dental materials have improved dramatically over the years and there are more options now than ever. But how do you know which ones are safe for you? Will they affect you on a cellular, immunological, energetic level? Is your immune system strong enough to handle all the challenges? How does your dentist even know? For example, crowns, bridges, and dentures are commonplace, and some of these contain nickel, junk metals, which may include chromium and cobalt. The CDC, Centers for Disease Control, claims that humans can be harmed from exposure to cobalt and cobalt-containing products. Most dental procedures will include using cements, adhesives, resins, acrylics, porcelains, and even the newer ceramics. All have different components and fillers that you may have a sensitivity to. There is a healthy solution to learn what your body's reaction may be to dental materials, but most traditional dentists may not even know about it. There's an inexpensive test that a holistic or biological dentist will know about and use called a serum biocompatibility blood test. This involves the simple drawing of your blood that is sent to a lab which specializes in exploring an individual's immune reaction to over 5,000 dental materials. This information, the dentist can be guided into deciding what dental materials are safe to use for you that will provide a lower immunological response, thus reduce your toxic exposure. Pretty cool? Well, to find a holistic dentist near you to help guide you in making those informed decisions, check out our online holistic directory. The link is in the description below. I hope you learned something about dental materials and how you can help yourself become safe in the dental office. Ask your dentist to prescribe for you the serum biocompatibility study. It's inexpensive and it is wonderful for the dentist to understand what he's going to put in your mouth and ultimately will be for the health benefit of you. Like us, hit that subscribe button, and in the description below, click on our website, explorerlistic.com, and also our online directory. Thank you for watching again. So long, and I'll see you soon. Bye.